Hello guys and welcome to a new video. In this video we will talk about Google Docs. Um, it's a technique that uh, you can do advanced search on Google. Okay, so you can find some weaknesses in uh, some websites. Okay, and uh, it can be useful for other purposes too. So you as uh, pen testers, you need to understand the technique of the hackers so you can protect the website for your client or something like that. Okay, so in order to use Google Docs, you need to have two simple things, internet connection and any browser, whether you're using PC, Mac, or even mobile phone. Okay, so let's start. Now you go and open your browser. Okay, I will just open a new node for you guys, so you can just paste those commands. Okay. Now, the first command we will have today is index of color. Then, without space, you write anything you need. I will show an example now. Let me copy it. As an example, if you want to download a movie without going to a website which is full of advertisements, you just write the name of the movie and you will have it. Okay, like just write HD movies. Let's click this link. A Bug's Life as an example. Then here you go. Whenever you click on the video file, it will be downloaded to your system. can download it directly so like this will make your searches faster you know okay let's search for source code here you go if you open this link in a new tab okay you will have the source code of it now another useful thing to have is adding this command by writing this now we'll have an index of source code which is Android related let me open this in a new tab As you can see, whenever you click on this one, like you can download it directly, okay? So, let me write this command too. Okay, for this command, we can call it must include. And let me write a third command for you guys, which is must exclude. ETC is just to refer about anything you want to write. Okay, now let's talk about our fourth command, which is site. Let me just erase this by writing site, colon. Then you can write any website you want to search about. Okay, let's search for Yahoo. You see, when you use the command site, okay, like you will have Google searches only related to Yahoo from this specific website. Okay, now if you must include something, you write plus, like news, and I can exclude 2019, then click on enter. Now you will have search results about this website, including news and excluding 2019 as an example. Okay, now let me write it for you. Now let's talk about the fifth one, which is entitled. Okay, now if you use this, you can specify searching by the title. Okay, let me paste it. As an example, Adobe 2020, click on enter. Now you will have specific search about this certain keyword. Okay, like as an example, let me include Download and click on enter. You see, now you will have direct download links to the specific software or search. Okay, so six one will be N URL. Let's copy this command and see what it does. Now, let's write any domain we want. As an example, dl 
www.google.com as you can see when you use this command you will have search results only about this specific URL that you have written so it will be easier for you if you're searching for specific URL using Google okay guys let's move to the seventh command which is cache we can use this command for showing cached version of any website let me copy it open my browser we'll just paste it and choose any link in this case it's Adobe as you can see when the page opens up like you will see two different versions beside the main version or the whole version okay if you click here on text only you will find out that you can have a text version from the website and if you click on view source you will see the programming of that particular site okay now let's move to number eight command which is in text which can be useful in searching in particular text in particular title in any url you add or maybe website or you just can directly search for it okay so let's try it okay as an example let's write in title Adobe and text username you will find the specific search results which you can find the Adobe in the title of that website or URL and the subtext or the site text username so you can be more specific about it okay some people do this by writing file type xls which is excel files then you click on enter let me just okay click on enter so once you write this like you will find some vulnerable websites okay as an example uh, for andrea Deca, this is their username the visa card number and something like that so this is uh, you as pen tester you need to check for all of that especially when you're pen testing for uh, a secure website or something like that you see how many people like their information is just exposed on google but like you need to find the right keywords to search for that okay let's now search on google for exposed cameras click on enter now let's check for this exposed cameras as you can see from this particular ip address that we found from google dorking okay we successfully entered a live view of exposed camera on the web and yeah that would be all about google dorking i will leave this file in the description thank you so much for watching